What's up, Bottle Poppers? It's uh, Peter Von Panda um, coming at you, recorded with the Satechi Bluetooth remote control for the iPhone, iPod, iPad, uh, works with various iOS accessories. It's uh, pretty small. It's about the size of, it's actually uh, a bit shorter than the Apple TV remote. It's plastic. It's super light. It's got a nice uh, fit and finish and looks good and it's it's uh, available in black and I believe white as well. This is about 40 bucks from various places but it pairs with, and I've paired it actually here with my iPhone because with the, the problem I had is that you jump into your car and if you have a hands-free um, phone system like this cruise does or my fiat does and you've got the phone paired to it you can use the siri for voice commands but if the phone's in your pocket it's really tough to pull it out and then you're holding the button down this is kind of nice because it's got a home button right here and what i really wanted to know is if i could use this home button and keep this remote control either mounted somewhere or have it accessible so that I can always grab this and just hit the home button down to activate Siri. And what I can now tell you for sure is that it works. And I'll give you a quick demonstration here. I've got my phone paired to this cruise, uh, the Bluetooth hands-free, and I've also got it paired here. It's pretty simple. You just turn the power on over here. So especially if you're gonna leave the car parked for a while, um, you don't need the remote. Uh, um, or you're worried about the battery life because it runs on a couple of watch batteries, I believe. Then you can just power it off. But to pair it, you just hit this little Bluetooth uh, button right there. Uh, find the the uh, device on your iPhone. It'll give you a code. You just enter it on this keypad. Hit enter, and then most of the time you're not going to see those numbers. But this button right here is the key. It's the home button, and so I'll just hold it down here. What time is it? The time is 6.13 p.m. So you can see that obviously it uh, it opens up Siri and controls it. If I just hit it once, Call it's going to go ended. back to the to the screen. Hands-free um, uh, protocol releases uh, the connection. So really nice. Just keep this anywhere. You want to give Siri a quick command, set up a schedule, send a text. It's, uh, it's, it's about as good of an option as you're going to get in a car that doesn't have the Siri eyes free system installed which really isn't going to happen until either later 2013 on some of the GM models or even later on some of the other cars so cool way to add a a Siri activation button in your car there's one other device that I'll be looking at uh, here shortly it's called mobile home and it's a device kinda like this but it only has one button and it's just the home button but it's about twice as expensive and uh, that looks like a cool option too and I'll show you more uh, as soon as I can test it but for about 30 or 40 bucks, this is really nice. Peter Von Panda for the Satechi Bluetooth iOS remote. Later! Woo, 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 woo!